you know, as we learn to adjust and cope with the realities of life, I really took some time this week to unpack, you know, what does it mean, not just for myself, but what I'm seeing or hearing. And the one thing that really stood out for me, and it's something that I feel um, it's out there for everyone too, is the ability to stay productive. Either staying productive in the job market, so working, either staying productive in looking for a job because you've been laid off or you were let go or you lost your job, Um, your ability to stay productive in the home, right? Bringing value to the home, to that safe space, to the relationship. These things have taken on a whole new meaning. And with these examples, what I've found is that there are potentially two reasons why we're having a hard time staying productive. Number one, we have internal conflicts. We're dealing with things on the inside of us, such as insecurity, self-doubt, um, imposter syndrome, uh, lack of confidence, lack of self-esteem, lack of self-awareness, because prior to the pandemic, we actually weren't really being taught how to be resilient in the face of adversity, how to cope with rejection, how to cope with failures, right? And now it's becoming costly to us. And number two is the external conflicts. We're seeing that, you know, with technology, we're getting more information thrown at us at every direction. We're getting um, loud noise of uncertainty. Um, we're, We're seeing in the world today how technology is being used for both good and potentially for for bad. And when the external conflicts are so loud that it's hard for people to filter and balance out themselves with the world, your productivity will suffer. So it's important to start to realize as an individual and making an individual choice how to balance your internal and external world, because that is the key to being productive. Making sure you've got this on the inside and the outside in balance. And if you can learn about yourself and learn how to strategize and cope with this, you'll succeed and prosper.